United Arab Emirates team organizing the COP28 climate talks that begins this week was planning to use its position as host of the summit to strike new oil and gas deals with foreign governments, a cache of leaked documents shows. The documents which were published by the UK Registered Centre for Climate Reporting appear to be briefing notes for Sultan Al Jabbar who will preside over the UN climate negotiations for meetings with foreign officials in the run-up to the summit. They are organized as country profiles with each document describing talking points for Al Zabar to raise in the meetings. The documents detail each country's climate progress in key areas including finance, decarbonizing food systems, uptake of renewables and identity how their ambitions could be raised. But among those points are also several suggestions to offer new oil and gas projects with the state-owned Abu Dhabi National Oil Company which Al Zabar leads. ADNOC did not reply to CNN's request for comment but the company previously told CNN that any suggestions it was using the climate talks to promote itself is incorrect and is baseless. The documents were first shared with the BBC, a COP28 team spokesperson told CNN in an email. The documents referred to the BBC articles are inaccurate and were not used by COP28 in meetings. It is extremely disappointing to see the BBC use unverified documents in their reporting. The spokesperson did not address CNN's question as to whether the COP28 team was operating independently of ADNOC, nor did they explicitly deny that the business interests were discussed.